Alright, what's up everybody? This is some Black Ops gameplay using the Galil Silence Rumble in the Jungle and I'm playing against some noobs. These guys on the other team suck. <laughs> I was playing Ground War Domination and Jungle was one of my favorite maps on Black Ops. If you're new to my channel, you never really saw my Black Ops gameplay, but this is nothing like my Black Ops gameplay. Um, Modern Warfare 3 has put me into a really, really rush happy mood. I do a lot of things in this match that I probably wouldn't have done in the past. I was a really conservative player. And I think I'm better now. I definitely think having a mixture of my defensive style and my aggressive style is the best combination to have. Uh, I am pretty rusty on this game. You see me rusty with the C4s. I, it takes me forever to pull it out. I actually get lucky that guy didn't knife me. But I already got my chopper and dogs out, so I'm not too worried about it. I end up getting blown up by RC car. Then I go ham in the chopper gunner. I'm actually going to cut out the choppers this match. Nobody really wants to see those. But yeah, guys, what I want to talk about is what is your favorite Call of Duty? Um, going back and playing Black Ops reminded me of some of the funner times I've had playing COD. And I want to know, what do you think was your most fun time? Me, personally, I think the most fun I've ever had playing Call of Duty was when I first started. And it's probably like that for most of you as well. So if Black Ops was your first Call of Duty, you probably had the most fun playing Blops. So, me is Modern Warfare 2. I absolutely loved the hell out of that game. I played it so much. It was the first game that I fell in love with on, on uh, PlayStation. Because the whole reason I even bought PlayStation in the first place was to play Call of Duty. And then I think a close second would probably be, probably be Black Ops for the reason of the overpowered killstreaks. I loved going going to town using Blackbird. I mean, you could you can either camp. You can pretty much guarantee yourself a Blackbird every match. I mean, all you really got to do is camp. Although, I don't recommend doing that anymore. I mean, the game's so old, you know, there's no reason to sit there and hide and head glitch behind stuff. I mean, just run around. The guys that play the game nowadays are not the are not the tryhards that are playing Mono for 3. They're the guys that suck, the little, uh, you know, eight-year-olds that don't know how to use a controller. Those are the guys that you'll find on there now, which is part of the reason why I got this gameplay. But anyways, uh, this is using the Galil Silence. Galil was one of my favorite guns in Black Ops. I don't like it as much as the Commando, but I don't have the Commando unlocked, otherwise I'd be using that. Galil is one of those guns that is hit or miss for me. Like whenever I use it, it either has really low recoil and it doesn't move at all like that shot right there. Or when I try to full auto it, it jumps all over the place and is really annoying. So that's why I like the Commando. It has a more predictable recoil pattern. Galil is really unpredictable. Right here, I'm getting lucky with my C4s. Look how slow I'm throwing them. <laughs> God, those things throw it so slow. Oh, another thing is, um, this was probably my best gameplay. Surprisingly, it was my best gameplay on the Xbox. If you don't know, I started... Well, I just told you I started on PS3 because I, I played Modern Warfare 2 on it. But I originally switched to the Xbox during Black Ops. I was really, really good with the PS3 controller. Just the way I was able to control and handle the sticks. And then I moved to Xbox, and I really struggled to learn this. And it wasn't until Modern Warfare 3 came out, maybe about a month into it, that I really had a, a good command over the controller, and I really got the movement down. So for me to go back and play Black Ops and to feel like I can still perform on a high level like I used to on PS3 is really refreshing. I'm so happy that, you know, I, I think I finally got over the, the controller conversion. So anybody that's thinking of switching from PS3 to Xbox or Xbox to PS3, Guys, you're gonna you're gonna have a hard time adjusting controllers. I mean, if you don't have a hard time doing it and you're just a natural like that, then so be it. But me personally, I had a hard time. I really struggled. Uh, if you go back and you search some of my old old Black Ops videos when I first switched over to Xbox, I talked about that all the time. I told you how much I hate the Xbox controller, and to this day, I still like the PS3 controller over it. But I'm so used to Xbox, I would never go back to PS3. Um, unless there was some benefit to it Like for me like for example me getting a free ps3 or something which is not gonna happen But right here the game's almost over I clutch out a chopper gun I didn't have time to go for the dogs. It was already 190 points, but I clutch out this last chopper gunner and I end up just going to town I actually show this one to you because I go ham the spawn ends up flipping to the C flag that equals death for them chopper gunner C flag jungle doesn't mix <laughs> if you get trapped on C with the chopper gunner up man you better you better run underneath the bridge you better pull out your Strela, Strela missiles and just hope that the other guy doesn't get like 20 kills off on you which most likely he will but yeah that's gonna be the end of this gameplay I think final score on this one was 108 8 deaths 
Uh, I probably could have broke 150. I think if I didn't die so much in between the second and third chopper guns, it would have been it would have been a wrap. I would have had 150. But hope you guys did enjoy this. And if you want to see some more Black Ops gameplay, leave me a comment and drop a like on this video. As always, guys, thanks for watching and peace.